This Norfolk and Western Class J steam locomotive last ran under its own power in 1959. For the past 18 years, it's been sitting in an outdoor museum in Roanoke, Virginia. But the N&W has now decided to put the big engine back into service to use in pulling passenger excursion trains. First, workmen spent two days making minor repairs on the locomotive and pumping gallons of oil and grease into the old bearings. Then, when all the necessary preparations had been made, two diesel engines arrived to tow the locomotive out of the museum. The diesels were hooked up to the steamer's tender car, and mechanics made a final inspection. Then the towing engines began to back up, and the locomotive moved for the first time in almost two decades. The towing activities attracted several hundred spectators. I'm from Loveland, Colorado, and uh, seeing a Class J back in operation is a tremendous event. These are the type of locomotives I watched uh, when I grew up in Meadowview, Virginia, and saw them go by at 70 miles an hour. The locomotive will first get a thorough inspection at the N&W shops in Roanoke. Then plans call for it to be towed to the Southern Railways shops in Birmingham, Alabama, where the restoration work will be done. NNW officials say they hope the engine will be puffing again by sometime next summer. Ted Stone for NBC News, Roanoke.